For the proper road trip, you need the proper gear. Now, I'm not talking about packing up your motorhome. I'm talking about tools such as this and this. You need the perfect playlist before you hit the road. At Thor Moto Coach, we've installed way more than a radio in your dash. It's a photo viewer. It's a jukebox. It's really a bigger version of your smartphone. And I can't wait to show you how it all works. First, let's get familiar with the controls. Pressing the knob turns the system on and off. This is also your volume and mute button. Now that you have the system on, Mode pulls up your mode menu. These buttons above and below the volume knob tune the radio and play the next track on your connected device. This is a USB input. This is a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary input. The little microphone symbol is your Bluetooth microphone and this is a micro SD card slot. From your main screen, your options are radio, dual mirror, USB, SD card, Bluetooth, phone and music, your backup camera, aux in, and your settings. The monitor button at the bottom controls the screen brightness. The three bars are for your equalizer and surround sound settings. Let's go through the settings icon first as this is where you pair up your phone for Bluetooth calls and music. Walking down the list, this is how you choose your language, set your wallpaper, calibrate the touch screen, set the clock, or turn the beep on or off when you press the keys. From here, you can also turn on the rear view camera, check your firmware, or do a factory restore. Tapping on these three lines brings up the audio control so you can fine tune the way your system sounds. RGB adjusts the aspect ratio of your touchscreen. The Bluetooth icon is how you pair your phone. To do that, enable Bluetooth on your phone. Tap on Auto Connect, then look for the system to show up on your phone, then simply pair the devices. With Auto Answer, by choosing on or off, the system will automatically answer your phone for incoming calls. Taking you back to the home screen, hit the radio button and your radio pops up. You tune in stations by holding these arrows. You can select a preset by holding down the buttons on this row and you can store up to 18 FM and 12 AM stations. Choose FM or AM here. This is for local and distance tuning and this is for stereo or mono. Pressing this stores the six strongest stations. Here are your EQ settings for when you need to pump up the bass. This button brings up even more options to control the surround sound. The crosshair grid is for your fader and balance. With Dual Mirror, you need to download the Dual Mirror app for your device. Now connect your phone to the system with an HDMI cord. Whatever is being displayed on your phone will now show up on the display screen. This is a great option for using the GPS system on your smartphone. With USB, all you need to do is pop a thumb drive right here and you can play music, look at photos, or play video. Same goes for the SD card. If you have DVD quality movies stored on it, music or photos, you simply pop it in and you can play the contents on the screen. With your phone paired to the system, tapping the Bluetooth phone icon allows you to make and receive hands-free calls. To play music from your Bluetooth connected device, you can touch this music note or the BT music icon on the main screen. The song being played will be displayed here. This button takes you to the previous track, and this button is for player pause, and this button skips ahead to the next track. The rear camera icon brings up your rearview camera. If you have an iPod or an older phone without Bluetooth compatibility, plugging a 3.5mm cord into the aux in allows you to play music through the system. Now that you know how it works, pop in your playlist and enjoy the ride. For more owner's resources, visit ThorMotorCoach.com.